Using gold and acrylic mediums and gels as adhesives for collage creates a permanent bond of the object onto a support. Although we will show four products being used, realize many other products are acceptable as adhesives. In this video, we selected just a few methods to highlight the many ways an artist can attach paper elements into their work. This first method works well with absorbent materials. We start by pouring polymer medium gloss into a tray. After loading up the brush, we then apply a thin coat of polymer medium onto the back of the image to seal the paper's absorbency. Next, a coat of polymer medium is applied to the substrate, and then both paper and substrate are allowed to dry. A layer of soft gel is applied to the back of the paper to serve as an adhesive. To achieve a strong bond, you need enough gel so that the surface remains wet while being glued down. Push out air bubbles and excess gel using a brayer roller and allow it to dry. Collage artists who prefer maintaining the look of the paper during their painting process may like using fluid matte medium as the adhesive. Fluid matte medium is poured into a tray and then water is added to reduce its consistency and the film thickness. I'm just using the brush to mix it up, but you can make the mixture beforehand if you prefer. Pour some water into a tray. The mixture is then applied evenly onto the surface of the substrate. Immediately the paper element is saturated in water and then patted dry. We're using a color laser copy for this demo because the inks are not water sensitive. After blotting off excess water, place it onto the area coated with the medium. The medium is brushed onto the paper, coating both sides simultaneously, and the brush is used to push out air pockets and wrinkles. As you can see, this technique provides a flat, low gloss surface once dried. For the final collage technique, we will be using a thick gel such as high solid gel gloss. The pasty nature of the gel offers the ability to apply a thicker layer of product. A thick layer of gel allows the artist some control over how smoothly the paper element lies as well as the ability to glue onto a more textured surface. Using a palette knife, apply the high solid gel evenly to the back of the paper. Glue the collage element down and with a clean palette knife, squeeze out as much excess gel as desired.